journey to Germany was so sad, so sad. Cameroonian student Caleb Gabila says wounds on his hand and neck were caused by a knife as he fled Ukraine. He's one of a group of African students who escaped after Russia invaded. Now in the German city Frankfurt, they've detailed the discrimination and violence they say they encountered. And everything passport. Gabila says unidentified persons grabbed his friend's bag shortly before they reached Poland's border. We started fighting and I, they were struggling to take mine, so I started fighting. So reached to a point, some, uh, someone moved, removed a knife, all of a sudden want to pierce me and, uh, and I was like, I got wounded. Tens of thousands of African students were in Ukraine when Russia began what it calls a special military operation. The African Union and the United Nations Refugee Agency have previously expressed concerns over reports that African students were being refused the right to cross borders safely. <laughs> Jeremy Musola, a 22-year-old medical student from Congo, says at the Polish border there was a group of foreigners and a group of Ukrainians. So it was easy for Ukrainians to go in Poland, but not easy for foreigners. And uh, so I couldn't even cross. So some of us were disappointed. The Polish Prime Minister's office has previously said that Poland provides shelter to everybody who is fleeing Russian aggression, regardless of their nationality and ethnicity.